Okay, I'm going to show you how to change Internet Explorer um, so it always opens in the desktop mode um, in Internet Explorer 10, um, which you'll be finding on Windows 8. At the moment, you're looking at uh, in desktop mode, which is probably what you're familiar with. Um, if we go onto the apps, we can actually go ahead and open up the um, the app mode um, or Metro mode, as we like to call it, which is sort of like the version that you might use if you have a tablet. Um, so if you have a tablet, I probably wouldn't recommend doing this. Um, okay, so we need to go to the control panel to change it. So we're just going to click on the control panel here, and then we're going to go to network and internet. Um, so when you're in network and internet, you can click on internet options. And then in internet options, there is a tab, which is the second from the last one, called programs. So I'm going to click on that. And when you're in here, the first one here is open in Internet Explorer. Um, and if you choose always open Internet Explorer, on the desktop and apply and OK that, it's always going to use the one on the desktop. So if you press a link in an email um, or if you're in an application and it wants to open up um, Internet Explorer, it's going to do it like this. We can also do this via group policies if you're in an organization. So I'm going to open up the local group policy editor. Um, if you're a home user, you probably won't need to use this. Um, so I've gone to GP Edit. Um, so this is going to be a computer configuration. Um, so it's going to apply to all your computers if you want to do it that way um, in group policy. So you're going to need to go to Administrative Templates under Computer Configuration here. And um, you can see on the left-hand side. So we're just going to drill into that one. And once you've drilled into that one, you next need to go to Windows Components. And the next one you need to go to after that is Internet Explorer. Okay, so once you're in Internet Explorer, you need to click on Internet Settings. You don't need to actually expand that out like I have, just left-click on it. And in the right window, you'll see Set How Links Are Opened in Internet Explorer. Um, at the moment, it's not configured, so you can double-click on it or right-click on Go um, Properties or Edit, I think it is. Um, and then you'll be brought up with this dialog box, and you can see it's not configured. So we change that to Enabled, and then we can choose from the drop-down box, Always Open Internet Explorer on the desktop. And if you apply and OK that, and if you're doing this on your domain controller, it's going to go to the ones you set it to go to. And then you just need to run GP Update Force on your clients, like this. And uh, once the policy is updated, they're going to have that setting configured, and they also won't be able to change it. So it's always going to open in the desktop mode, which is going to be preferred for users. hope it's been useful, and thanks for watching. If you want to see more of my tutorials, then please subscribe.